The Montgomery City Council voted to stop the change in health insurance providers for retired city employees. And this comes after an executive decision was made to change from Blue Cross Blue Shield. WSFA 12 News reporter Monet Stevens breaks down how this affects the future of their health insurance plan. It was nearly a split vote among the city council as they voted on whether to stop or allow the change in health insurance providers for retirees. Just two weeks ago, retired city employees were frustrated to learn that they could go from using Blue Cross Blue Shield to Amwin's Group Benefits LLC beginning the first of the year. Some retirees feared that they would lose their Medicare supplemental insurance, which concerned Councilman Glenn Pruitt. So when those people were hired 30, 40 years ago, they came to work to the city of Montgomery for pennies on the dollar. Now, any changes to the city's retirement health insurance plan could go through one final approval based on the recommendation from the city administration. And you have nine council members that represent the whole city. And they, I think, need to be brought in on this. While five of the council members believe that any changes to the retirement health insurance plan should be given a final approval by the council, four still believe that it should be left up to the chief financial officer. I believe it's our project to leave day-to-day administrative tasks to the day-to-day -day operations and administrative team. District 3 Councilwoman Marsha Johnson says the city should put their trust in the CFO to make the right decision that keeps city retirees from paying more out of pocket. Our CFO has been here, you know, and worked with some of these same retirees and she'll retire soon. So the things that they recommend, it won't be to hurt anyone. Monet Stevens, WSFA 12 News, Montgomery. And a city spokesperson released a statement saying in short that they will evaluate the council decision and determine if the mayor will sign or veto the ordinance.